What is up everybody? This is John with Archer Fish. I am back at Lake Kachuma as you can see and the reason why, look at this sky. Overcast, a little drizzly. It's cooler but not cold. Um, this is a great reaction by weather as I found with this lake and that's what I'm all about right now. Just trying to get an exciting bite going on. I would love to try to catch some bigger fish so I'm trying a completely different side of this lake. I'm going down south where all the sticks are, the warmer water, the island. I know there's tons of fish. There's tons of fish everywhere on this lake, pretty much. So I'm just trying some new spots today, a few new techniques, try to catch some bigger fish. I don't think I've gotten anything over three pounds um, on this lake, and I've caught like 200 fish. So uh, I'm all about the big fish today. That's what I'm going to try to do. And of course, the reaction bite. So I'll see you in a minute. <laughs> first spot again I'm trying something a little different today as you can see there's this uh, nice uh, outcropping here it's usually covered in water this little island here and it's great fishing when it was covered in island or covered in island it was covered in water in the fall so I'm gonna throw the old uh, lucky craft jerk bait around it and see if I can't get a reaction strike today would be awesome. I have seen some good sized fish around this spot. Um, but I haven't really fished it because it's usually there's a lot of people around. So you see, people ask my techniques. Um, as far as like how I work certain baits. And honestly, like with the jerk bait, I just, I burn it in, as you can see. I just whip it pretty quick. And I've, I've noticed that I, if I do pause it, I do get hit on the pause as you know, most people like to work it like that, but I've had success just burning it in, so. No, I don't know. If this is holding any fish. Oh. oh, that's a fish, that's a fish. Oh, I was gonna say a nice fish, but I can never tell with these, these fish. It's like about the same size. I didn't even know I had a fish. Um, it's funny, I was just about to say, I don't know if this is holding fish, you know. I just don't know if this is a spawning area or not. Oh, there you go same spot all right okay. all right I'm gonna show the fish to you but and again with the jerk bait what I like to do is try different angles of the same point or drop off there's one no way oh I lost him again going off this side one so like I've said in other videos oh got him in the gill as I said in other videos you catch these bass in the side not because they're you're snagging them but because they come up and ram the bait with their body shout out to uh I think they're uh, underwater optic. I think uh, cool guys. Met them last uh, last year actually. But yeah, they have a YouTube. Check it out. All right. Thanks, buddy. All right, little guys, quick release. So again, I just kind of switched the direction in which I was throwing at this um, point here. So. Can't tell if there's a fish or a branch.
Throw the old sink over there. Just in case it's a bed. Oh, nice smallie. Protecting a bed. I grabbed my jig first and uh, took it off the bed. Not bad. Not bad little small mouth here. So, I threw the Sanko to make sure I felt it. Buddy, not a bad fish, huh? Oh, yeah. Just in case that is a bed back there, there's a big female. Oh, good fish. Didn't even know I had a fish on, honestly. Oh, good fish. This is a net, baby. Oh, come on. Oh. Really? Baby. That's what I'm talking about. That's a good fish right there, guys. That is a healthy, heavy spawning fish. That's a beauty. Oh man, that's a really good fish. All right, that was cool. That was probably, that was the biggest fish I've caught here in a while, and it was only three pounds. So um, chunky spawning fish, tiny head, but man, fat belly. And it was cool. I just came into this little quiet cove, just trying a new strategy to try to see if I can find some of these bigger spawning fish that are kind of, you know, a little more out of the way, out of the main lake, out of the main bays, just kind of uh, hiding out somewhere. So that is the plan for today. Good fish. show you what I'm using on my jig rod here. Just a, this is the Bandito Bug from Guggen Squad. Um, I'm using this one. I have another, I had another bait that I was on here. I think it was just too big of a profile, so I like this thing because it's really small. Got an eighth of an ounce tungsten weight, bullet weight, size two um, hook. Just got a Texas rigged here. That's it. Just, just cover a lot of water with it. A little baby geese. Then might be a big fish off this point right here. Gotcha. 
typical fish over here not too big but fun to catch all right I'll take that gobbled it up son thanks homie good looking fish Should have been keeping an eye. Same fish. Oh, good fish. Good fish. Big old smolly. Awesome, dude. I'm gonna get this out. It's not as big as it looked. That's a good fish. They fight like crazy. Thanks, pal. Chunkier fish. Cannot keep them pinned. Oh, man. Got. Damn sunblock all over my hands. Homie decided to. Yes. God, oh. Feels good. Feels way bigger than this. I got you, buddy. Just a beautiful, oh, beautiful place back here. Just all the same size fish. Oh, good fish, good fish. Better fish. God, dog. Bad. Not what I'm looking for. Woo! Fired up. Well, it's either small or swimming towards me. Smally. These suckers fight. That's pretty cool. If you want to catch smallmouth, most of the time, and this is true for today, um, hit the deeper points, main lake stuff, deeper, rockier, colder. That's where they like to spawn, that's where they like to hang out. It's always your case at this lake and at Castaic. Feels good. Oh, it's a good fish. Oh, I got a net him. Oh. 
Look at that. That's a good one. A little bit bigger, you know, maybe two and a half. Gorgeous fish. Decent fish. Not too bad on the jig. So I caught a bunch more fish, uh, a few on the jerk bait, a few on the Senko. Um, some of the footage was just not usable because I uh, was rolling. And then as soon as I caught a fish on the jerk bait, um, I hit stop. I did that a few times. So you catch uh, all the footage up to the point where I catch a fish. So I just excluded all that stuff. Uh, and a lot of the Senko fish were about the same size. It's all those like pound fish, you know, if they're even a pound. Um, so yeah, that is it. Thanks for watching. I'll see you tomorrow.